Hey, what's going on, everybody? Sean 1014 here with another gameplay, doing some domination on resistance. Brought to you by my man Tivu Empire, and he does his thing like always. Uh, you know, Tivu's going to start off. I love how he always he always goes to the B flag. Like he'll always be on us. Go B, go B, and we're like, dude, we don't want to die. And he still gets the fucking thing. I don't know, but uh, <laughs> I hope everything everybody's doing well. Hope everything's going good for everybody and. Uh, I'm glad you came back to the channel. Check out another video by us. A uh, couple things I want to talk about uh, with me personally is uh, you've already noticed that uh, I've been directing over at Vexon Games. I'm real excited about that. Uh, I'm working my partnership now, so real good things there. I'm really happy about that. And I'm really happy with the direction that Vexon's going. And a couple things I want to talk about, and, and it's probably not talked about enough, is, you know, we're trying to bring something different, you know. You can see guys camp for Moabs and, and all that good stuff, but to see a real quality domination game, a, a game where you're moving around, you're capturing flags, you're not worried about your KD as much, and, and, and you're just trying to win. I mean, I don't know where in Call of Duty the, the thought got lost on people that winning wasn't the objective. I mean, you can beat somebody's ass in domination, and then they'll so they're oh, well, I had fifty four kills and six deaths. It's great. You're still a fucking loser, you know. <laughs> I mean, you're the, you're in the wrong game. I don't I don't I don't get it. It it's really drives me crazy. And it happens pretty much every lobby uh, we get into, and it, it's fucking annoying as shit. But yeah, anyway, that's my little rant on that. Uh, other than that, I want to talk about just uh, Vexon in general. I'm I'm real excited with, like I said, what the direction is going. Uh, things are looking up. Uh, if you don't know too much about Vexon, it's a smaller entertainment group that partners gamers and uh, musicians, and they do you know Call of Duty, any type of first person shooter, RPGs, MMORPGs. I mean, all that good stuff. And they also do graphic design. And I'll have links to all those in the show more below. So make sure you guys check that out because those a lot of those directors are real good, and you'll see some <laughs> you'll see some interesting games on there that you probably haven't thought about in quite some time. So, but uh, other than that, I mean, like I said, the partnership thing's coming. I'm really happy about that. I'm real excited to you know finally get going. I, I've busted my butt off on uh, YouTube, and you know I've only been on for a short amount of time. But I've always had positive feedback, which real you know has always been real exciting to me. It's that pos positive reinforcement that what I'm doing people like, and you know it's a real joy for me. So you know, once again, thank you to the YouTube community for the folks subscribed to me and for the folks you know that like watching my content because I really like making it. There, there's really, I mean, when you when you do it and, and you see the finished product, you I mean, you're honestly as a director, you're so proud of it, you know. And when people, you know shit on it or whatever you're just like fuck man well fuck <laughs> but when people really like you, you're like yeah yeah i did do a good fucking job you know i did i did a great job i'm really excited about this and it's a real good feel good moment so and now with that now and i've heard some other directors some other commentators talking about this. i mean is anybody else really i mean modern warfare 3 is really kind of taking its toll on me now and i'm really I mean, it's almost the same, same thing, you know. They got yeah, they're bringing terminal back, which that's really cool. Uh, I didn't really get to play it too much or at all, really. I was deployed during that time when that game was out, so I pretty much missed all of uh, Modern Warfare 2. But uh, I don't know. I, I'm just I haven't been feeling it here lately, you know. And uh, so I've been moving, out, you know, trying out some different games. I'm, I'm a real big MMO fan, so I've been trying out, you know, some RPGs and stuff like that. And I've uh, been doing it for Vexon's RPG channel. And, you know, that's going really well. I've actually gotten really positive feedback about that. And then obviously DDO I've done on my channel for a little bit now. Uh, I need to get back into that as well. But uh, it just seems so much the same. I mean, and, and the campers are really you know they're they're out in force i mean <laughs> really driving me crazy right now but uh so i've been real busy guys i've been uh at work and everything and obviously with the wife and the kids and stuff and then trying to get this vexon thing going and 
you know, I'm really glad I got guys like uh, Tivu and Chronic that want to help on the channel because, you know, I don't always have the time to get on there and, and then put out the content that I really want to put out for you guys. And these guys don't have a way to record or post, so it works out really well. And especially, AOA, I love this. Watch this. He's going to fucking brave heart this damn sentry gun. Rawr! Dumbass sentry gun. Okay, no fear. No fear. <laughs> He actually has some interesting moments in this game. It was really it had me cracking up when I was watching it. I was just like, really? Like, look at this guy. Call me Chris Angel because you just got fucking mind freaked. Holy shit. That dude had no clue what the fuck was going on. He was just staring the other direction, trying to go, I'm going to go up the stairs. I'm going to go up the stairs. No. Like, right. Is it right here? Now, here in a little bit, you'll see what I'm talking about. There are some interesting moments that happen in this game. That uh, there's one. There's a there's like a group uh, orgy, yeah, which was you know always always fun. I, I'm a big fan of those. Now, hey, check this fucking grenade out. Ah, uh, call me Peyton Manning, except my neck's gonna last the season. Tivu Empire throwing strikes. Good lord. That shit had me tripping out when I saw that. I was just like, and look at this guy. He's like, oh, let me back that ass up. Oh, you a big fine Tivu, let me back that ass up. <laughs> what the fuck was he doing? I don't even care if he just spawned there. Like, he, he ran right by him. Like, that's the guy that presses, you know, square or whatever it is for Xbox to respawn and just immediately starts running. Like, doesn't pay attention to anything around him. He's just like, I got to get back to the fight. Well, you just passed the fucking fight, guy. <laughs> that shit had me dying. But, uh, you know, Tivu, I mean, what can you say about this guy? He's always aggressive. He's always on the move. I love that. He puts up these amazing KDs rushing, and and so does Chronic. It, and you'll, you'll see a gameplay from him in a couple of days. Yeah, the dude's insane. If you guys haven't had a chance to check it out, I've been working on some different content for the channel. I'm trying not to just keep it Modern Warfare 3. Uh, I always like to mix it up, and there's other games I enjoy. Uh, one, I'm, I'm thinking about going back to a classic uh, RPG with uh, Maple Story. Um, that game has been around for fucking ages. It's like a side-scrolling RPG, but it's badass. Like, that game's sick. And then... Uh, Obviously, I got a, my series I'm doing on Vexon RPG, which uh, covers free-to-play MMOs and World of Tanks and stuff like that. So I'm doing five episodes for them, and then I move it to my channel. So I'm real excited about that because the one I'm doing right now for uh, Dragon's Nest is like, has gotten really cool feedback. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, what happens when three guys are in a room? I don't know. They all three had guns, but it looked kind of kind of interesting. They were sitting there like the Fantastic Four. Flame on! <laughs> but anyway, guys, this gameplay is starting to wind down here. We got 195 to 95. TV beasting it again. Look at Thanks for keeping my spot warm, buddy. Whew, I really needed a nice warm spot to lay down my predator. All right. <laughs> but, uh... There you go, 200 to 97 is the winning score. Make sure you guys press that like button. Make sure you guys check out those Vexon channels below. Give Tivu some love. He deserves it. He's a badass player. And look at the gold AK. Mm -mm -mm. Take care, guys. Shron1014, and I am out.